Welcome or welcome back, Cyber Explorers. It's Chris, and in this video, we'll explore together with this step-by-step -step guide how to check partition style MBR or GPT in Linux systems. So without further ado, let's get right into it. Method one, open a terminal window. Type sudo fdisk hyphen L and press enter. This will display a list of all the storage devices connected to your system. Look for the disk label type in the output. If it shows DOS, that means it is using the MBR scheme. If it shows GPT, that means it is using the GPT scheme. To run fdisk on a specific device, you need to specify the device as an argument. For example, to run fdisk on dev SDA, you would type sudo fdisk forward slash dev forward slash SDA and press enter. Please note that you might need to install the fdisk package if it's not already installed on your system. You can do this using your distribution's package manager. For example, apt install fdisk on Debian-based systems. Please note that you need to have administrative privileges to install packages on your system. If you're not logged in as the root user, you'll need to use sudo before each command. For example, sudo apt install fdisk on Debian-based systems. Method two, if you prefer a graphical interface, you can use the GNOME disks utility. Open your applications menu and look for the disks app and open it. This will display a list of all the storage devices connected to your system. Click on the disk that you want to check, for example, dev SDA or dev SDB, and here you will find the disk information. Here you will see if your partitioning is master boot record, Josh MBR or good partition table, Josh GPT. Please note that you might need to install the GNOME disks utility package if it's not already installed on your system. You can do this using your distribution's package manager, for example, apt install GNOME disk utility on Debian-based systems. Please note that you need to have administrative privileges to install packages on your system. If you're not logged in as the root user, you'll need to use sudo before each command. For example, sudo apt install gnome disk utility on Debian-based systems. And that's it for today. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up, consider subscribing, and don't forget to activate the notification bell so you won't miss out on any new uploads. Thank you for watching, and I can't wait to share more with you. So, until next time, see you later.